Hello, hello everyone. On today's episode of The Sims, we have the adventure beginning. For a certain little household, my roleplay characters. For well, you see, we have Mr. Cassius Evans, who was uh, my first roleplay character. One of which that was a cowboy that uh, later became a deputy, senior deputy, and so on and so forth. We also have, let me decipher through the beginning, David Hollow. Now this one happened to be a bit of a murderer. We're gonna see what happens when a lot of our personalities happen to uh, try and coexist in one house. And of course over here we got Liam Royley, so you know, this one happened to be my Irishman. We've had a few, but uh, I guess this is like the uh, later one, so Liam O'Reilly, uh, yeah, and that is who that happens to be. We've got Charles Campbell, so, uh, yeah, another one of my criminals. Alexander Williams, of course, who uh, was a gentleman of refined taste. You got bloody Dean Campbell, mate. How's the fucking going, you know? He uh, happens to be, you know, a GTA mechanic sometimes. Fucking working on the cars, figuring out what people want for their cars. You know, bloody good paying job. Fucking new bumper. Who knows? Well, well we do have uh, Mr. Terrell Langston, sir. So Terrell uh, happens to be quite a nervous Englishman. The world doesn't really like the shooting and such. And it's usually quite timid of things. And, uh, yes. This happened to be another one of my deputies, uh, Dorian Kelshaw. Out of there. So, uh, Dorian was a bit of a different gentleman. Uh, we'll see how all this, uh, household unfolds when uh, all these personalities intertwine and intermingle. Let's see how they go. There we go, some people are meeting, talking, introducing, ah oh, yes, there we go. Mm -hmm. Getting to know each other. Oh, seems we already have a little bit of a problem. Mr. Evans and Mr. Alexander are not uh, the happiest with each other. Oh, it does appear that Dorian is already wandering off to uh, check the computer or something. Seems that uh, Mr. Hollow would like to talk to Liam. Mr. Evans has gone for a walk as well. It does appear that Dorian is the first one to get the computer. I do a bit of a look over. I've at least put doors on this place, right? I'm not too sure what he's doing, but... Ah, he's browsing art. That makes him happy. Inspired. Mr. Evans does not seem too comfortable. Ah, from the poorly decorated living environment, he's uh, very unhappy. Oh, the floor just seems off. Perhaps Indeed. that'll help Mr. Uh, alleviate some of our problems. Mr. Evans not being too happy with living environments. Ah. It does appear that he is quite sad. Mr. Evans is not a very happy camper. Perhaps let him do uh, a little bit of playing some games. That might make him happy. Maybe he's a little tense. Oh, he hates video games. Loathes them. Most people seem to be quite Unfortunately, happy that did not appear to be the fix for Mr. Evans. Except for Mr. Evans. Ah. Hangam and Bros has made, uh... Mr. Liam quite happy with himself. Ah. It does appear that that is working out for him. Ah. Mr. Evans is happy learning jokes. Well, it does appear that he would like to go for a chalk. Ah, 
There we go, Mr. Evans. Go for a job. It does appear that that is a desire of his. What is, uh... It does appear that... To become an energized, I have to work out, or drink a coffee, or take a brisk shower. Oh. Not too sure what to do with Mr. Dean. It does appear that he's quite happy with life, though. Enjoying hanging out with the bros. A lot of people seem to be quite happy with themselves. As we have a guest who has arrived. And is being ignored. Shalbo. <laughs> Seems a few of them are quite enjoying the uh, Yaba, Wisub. Uh, oh, Lempima. Whenever Terrell is gaming, Terrell is as one with the universe. Is it safe to say he likes video games? Sure. <laughs> Scoring simoleons. Check on the career panel, craft an object, earn 250. Lifelong aspirations, complete a task in any aspiration. Well, become angry. It's been a while. Oh, well, yes. He's feeling a little tense. He hasn't been angry with somebody in a while. We did have a neighbor who was around. Ah. Oh, why, why did David say that? It does appear that David is not too happy with himself. David, what are you doing? David appears to be going to the toilet. Never mind. Apologies, David. Oh, Mr. Evans has found himself at the computer, browsing the web. He's feeling a little bit more fulfilled after that. It seems that a few people would like to listen to some carnival music. First there we day. go. We are having quite an interesting time. Perhaps it's time that uh, David got to work in his criminal enterprise. I believe there are other things that are... Uh... Yes, there we go. Now hiring tough guys. Give a few of you your jobs. I believe Charles would also like to get a job. There we go. Two of them uh, will be on their criminal paths, of course. Dean, on the other hand... Well, let's see if there's any handy-dandy jobs for Dean. What would Dean like to do with himself that is available in this town? Ah, oh, astronaut? Probably not. To be honest, uh... I do believe that manual labor may be the employ. Mr. Dean Campbell. There we go. Grana Ura. Naba Florzo. Yano Zorpul. Blaho Quarb. Snoof. Choba Quimsba. Beba Zimboy. Chatting with Dean, it appears that Alexander is having a good time of it. He's feeling rather confident with himself. Arbin do four. Oh. He loves the things. Well, it does appear that he's feeling quite happy with himself. Ah, it does seem that Dorian has the sads. Feeling a little bit gloomy with himself. Dorian doesn't have a job. Unfortunately, Dorian sends himself to bed to have a bit of a cry. That should make him feel better. He just needs to cry it out. 
Now it does appear that Terrell is feeling quite fabulous at the moment. Perhaps it's time to see what kind of career Terrell would look into. Hmm, what would be Terrell's business? He'd be a freelancer. He could be a writer, a digital artist, a programmer. Ah, working within the arts. Although, style influencer. I do feel that this may be the path for Terrell. Terrell did uh, quite like being a hatter back in the day. Alright, well, Terrell has got a career as well. Accept the assignment. There we go. All right, Smurge off you go, Terrell. Lamita Noonkim, shape it. Launch it. Ah. Shimre Parla Dimp. Say ah. As everyone slowly gets into uh, the gist of things and their role in the world, hanging out in here tends to be their favorite location. It should make them a little bit happier. It does appear that Kel Shore is uh, still feeling mood and gloom. <laughs> Seems that Mr. Kel Shore has decided to uh, sort some things out. Ah, David Hollow has identified a goldfish. After speaking with Mr. Cassius Evans, he's learned about goldfish. Dorian seems to be set on cooking. Putting out a little bit of food over here. Hopefully he doesn't burn it. As uh, Alexander kind of tries to give him some tips, perhaps. Oh, there's a problem. Oh no. Well, it does appear that he's slowly getting the hang of this cooking thing. Alexander has attempted to tell him a joke or two. Dag, dag! Huh? It does appear that uh, Terrell would like to have a chat with uh, Dorian. Ah, there we go. Terrell feels a little bit better for uh, making sure that Dorian was informed. Oh no. Well, it appears that uh, Terrell may have smelled himself, disliked the uh, smell that he smelled, and uh, decided he needed to go to the toilet. Such is the nature. Alexander would also like to have a word. It appears poor Dorian cannot catch a break, as uh, all he wants is time to himself, and everyone keeps harassing the poor lad. He just wants to eat his food in peace, but... It appears that everyone wants to have a chat. There you go, Mr. Kelshaw. Charles' new skill in mischief will allow him to trick others with the hand buzzer as a skill. Instead of increasing the mischief interactions will be interacted. There we go. Somebody's having a bath. Ah, I see. Mr. Cassius is the one having a bath. I well, yes, I suppose. We don't really want to peep too much into that. Moochie Peachy, go on. Uh huh. Does appear. Liam is having a very good time being a bro. Arbinduba, Vinay, Mooch Quos. 
Oh, Iklavov. Best take of Shoid. Oh. Cooking is going around, I see. It does seem that Charles is doing some learning. David's done some cooking. And everyone seems to be getting on rather well. Having a good start to uh, things as they go. It seems that... Uh, Mr. Evans is not too upset anymore about the fact that the wallpaper is not, uh, you know, completely covering everything that he would probably like. But everyone has to start somewhere, and it appears that uh, Mr. Alexander will be starting in the mail. Here's he forgot about the food that he was making, and uh, seems to be quite hungry. For the most part, we'll try not to interfere too much in their lives and let them go about their way. Gee, what exactly did they do on their natural path this lecture? Although it does appear they definitely need some money in order to be able to uh, go about living a happier life, I think they'll need some gym equipment. Perhaps in the front room. Let's give them a little bit of a speed up and see if anything interesting happens. Well, at least, uh, it does appear that Charles did clean up with the, after himself eventually. Some people are quite happy to take naps on the couch. There we go. Here's David has found his way to his room at least, and will be taking a nap as well. Most people are sleeping other than Mr. Alexander, who's decided gaming at this hour is a good spend of his time. <laughs> Alexander has identified the guppy. Reported in fishing spots from Dean Campbell. Acquired the cooking skill. Work for Cassius starts in about one hour. Work for Alexander starts in about one hour. Well, hopefully they've, uh, they're intending to go to their jobs. Without uh, too much of an issue. Starts about one hour. What would you like to do? Work from home. Go to work. There we go. Send him off to work. Ah, <laughs> does appear that uh, somebody is already not happy with their job. Alexander, of course, you know, never really intended for this lot in life, but nonetheless, some people have to. Off goes Sorel, with a mask on. Off goes Cassius to work, and three of our fellows have gone to work. <laughs> Mr. Liam is happily living his life, splashing in the bathtub. Ah, oh, he's tired. Alexander is tired and will need to rest soon. Unfortunately, Mr. Alexander decided to stay up all night playing games. So uh, his problem seems to be the fact that he uh, may have misused his time. Well, I suppose that does uh, sort us out for a first day. It'll be interesting to see what they get up to next time.